The Passionate Shepherd to His Love by Christopher Marlowe, 1564 to 1593. Come live with me and be my love, and we will all the pleasures prove that valleys, groves, hills and fields, woods or steepy mountain yield. We will sit upon the rocks, seeing the shepherds feed their flocks by shallow rivers to whose falls melodious birds sing madrigals. I will make thee beds of roses and a thousand fragrant posies, a cap of flowers and a kirtle embroidered all with leaves of myrtle. A gown made of the finest wool, which from our pretty lambs we pull, fair lined slippers for the cold, with buckles of the purest gold. A belt of straw and ivy buds, with coral clasps and amber studs, and if these pleasures may thee move, come live with thee and be my love. The shepherd's swains shall dance and sing for thy delight each May morning. If these delights thy mind may move, then live with me and be my love. Okay, this poem is by Christopher Marlowe. Let's see, he um, was born and brought up in Canterbury. And he was one of the most famous uh, playwrights and poets of the Elizabethan era. Um, they say that um, Shakespeare uh, followed him closely as well. Marlowe became famous before Shakespeare and Marlowe um, died an early death if we look age 29 um, and after that then that's when Shakespeare's fame uh, really started. So what's this poem about? Well this poem is about somebody who is um, talking to a shepherd or a shepherdess um, and asking them to come and be his lover and he's explaining and laying out all of the wonderful things that this person will do do for the shepherd if they become his love. Um, notice there is also a poem echoing this that follows this idea by Oscar Wilde. Well, actually there are a pair of poems they're called My Voice and Her Voice and they follow the same scheme and the same idea. So if you're interested, watch those as well. Oh, I also forgot to say that Christopher Marlowe uh, went to uh, Corpus Christi College, Cambridge. So let's look at it in more detail. Come live with me and be my love. So this is very clear. Come and live with me, be my lover and we will all the pleasures prove. I think here they, he's using the word prove as in taste, try, that valleys, groves, hills and fields, woods or steepy mountains yield. So we will enjoy all of the pleasures that valleys, groves, a grove is a small area of trees, hills, fields, woods or steepy, steep mountains yield. So we will try all of the pleasures that these places provide. We will sit upon the rocks seeing the shepherds feed their flocks. So we can sit on uh, rocks looking down on the shepherds feeding their flocks of uh, sheep or goats. By shallow rivers to whose fall melodious birds sing madrigals. So 
we will sit on these rocks and these rocks will be near shallow rivers shallow not deep and these rivers have waterfalls um, and there are birds singing they're singing beautiful madrigals a madrigal is a song for various voices and this is a very nice metaphor because a madrigal is a song uh, for various people very often unaccompanied by music um, and this is the birds singing so notice falls madrigals but he's Mm, smoothing the rhyme. There are, they are close rhymes in various of these, but they're not exact rhymes. And I will make thee beds of roses and a thousand fragrant posies. So I will make you a bed of roses to sleep on. I think clearly just the petals and not the thorns. And a thousand fragrant posies. A posy is a little bunch of flowers and fragrant with beautiful smells. A cap of flowers, so something to put over your head with flowers. And a kirtle embroidered all with leaves of myrtle. So a kirtle is like um, a small coat or a small jacket to go o o over you. Clearly related to the word girdle and then um, it's embroidered, it's sewn or with or it's got leaves of myrtle in it and myrtle is a common flowering plant that I that smells quite nice. A gown made of the finest wool which from our pretty lambs we pull. So I'll make you a dress of the very best wool yeah and this wool will come from the beautiful lambs that we're looking after we pull the wool from the lambs fair lined slippers for the cold so slippers for your feet and these are lined and i would guess they're lined with the wool of the lambs to keep out the cold and with buckles this is like a, a little metal piece over the center maybe to close the slippers and the buckle will be made of gold so he's going to give her the, this shepherd the very best of everything a belt of straw and ivy buds with coral clasps and amber studs okay so a belt made of straw made of dry grass and made with the uh, flowers or the buds of ivy another plant with coral clasps, so the clasp, the bit that holds the belt together, the buckle, will be made of coral and it will have amber studs, bits of amber in the belt. And if these pleasures may thee move, come with, live with me and be my love. So if these pleasures move me, if it move you, if these pleasures mm, are something that you want, then come with me, be my lover, be my love. Notice, buds rhymes with studs, but move and love. They're close, but they're not exact rhymes. The shepherd's swain shall dance and sing for thy delight each May morning. So, the swains of the shepherd, these are the, um, uh, the people who work for the shepherd, or maybe even their girlfriends, yeah? And on May morning, on the 1st of May, um, it's, it's traditional to do the dance round the maypole. And um, if you come with me, you'll see the... Um, these people dancing and singing for you to enjoy on May morning. If these delights thy mind may move, then live with thee and be my love. Okay, so if you feel moved by this, then come with me. Come, come and be my lover. Okay, so sing morning, 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 sing and sing each May morning. Okay, and move and love again. And that's it. So enough. If you enjoyed the video, 
give it a rating, subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you soon. Bye for now. The Passionate Shepherd to His Love by Christopher Marlowe